All right, Chief Prine. Yeah, true. Okay. Y'all good to go? All we'll right. Go. Tell us what unfolded tonight. Yeah, so tonight about 8.30, uh, we had two groups of individuals in the self-checkout line here at the Walmart on the belt line that's behind me. Uh, apparently an altercation ensued uh, where the two groups exchanged gunfire. Uh, how many uh, is not known at this time, obviously, at this part is under investigation. Uh, we had two individuals, a male and a female, uh, incidentally, that was struck by gunfire. Uh, they have both been transported to the local hospitals to be treated for their injuries. Uh, their condition is unknown at this time. Uh, I do not know what the altercation was about, but I want to make sure uh, that we understand that the situation is consolidated. We have it under control. Uh, there are no shooters here. There is no active shooter. It was an altercation between, between two groups of people. Do we know if any employees were injured in this? Uh, we have two individuals that were injured as to their status, as if they're employees or patrons, or even if they're involved, it's unknown at this time. No fatalities, right? No, no fatalities. Um, do we know where in the store this happened? Uh, my understanding, it was in the self-checkout uh, toward the east side of the store. Did the two people know each other? Uh, that is unknown at this time. That part is under investigation. Obviously, there's a lot we have to learn going forward, uh, but as we get that information, we'll certainly make it available to you. Did the building ever go into lockdown? Um, to my understanding, uh, yes, uh, but to what extent and at what portion, I'm not sure. Yep. And is the Walmart remaining closed for the rest of the evening? Uh, I would surmise and say yes. All right, we'll keep you updated as it goes on, okay? Thank you. Thank you. You bet. All right, you've been listening to Mobile Police Chief Paul Prime there update us on what happened at the Walmart on the Beltline. He said that two groups were at the self checkout line when some kind of argument happened and then gunshots were fired. We know that a male and a female were both hit by bullets. It's unknown their condition. It's unknown if they worked at Walmart or if they were part of the two groups who were arguing. So not a whole lot coming out of that um, brief interview right there with the chief. But we do know that he said the Walmart possibly went into a brief lockdown. We know everybody has been moved out. He said the situation is under control and there is no active shooter. He says there is no shooter at the Walmart right now. He did not say that there have been any arrest either. So a lot unfolding here, but we do know that shots were fired inside of the Walmart. Two people, a woman and a man were hit by gunfire. Their conditions are unknown. It's unclear what exactly exactly happened, but Chief Prine says that two groups were in some sort of argument at the self checkout at that Walmart on the Beltline when gunfire erupted. Of course, a scary situation. A lot of people messaging us asking what's going on here. A lot of people were in that Walmart at the time. We're going to continue to ask questions about this. You can see a heavy police presence still at the Walmart there. Do not come to this area. If you have to stay away, it's still in lockdown. You can see the caution tape there outside of the Walmart. Police, though, saying that they have the situation under control and there is not an active shooter. So if you're just joining us again, once again, we just heard from the chief. He said two groups got into an argument. A woman and a man were shot inside of that Walmart. It's unclear who they were, if they were employees, if they were just in the Walmart at the time, or if they were part of the two groups that were arguing. We'll, of course, continue to follow this story. Our uh, Lacey Beasley is live on scene. Uh, if we get any new information on this, we will be sure to let you know. But again, a very active scene. Stay away from the Beltline Walmart at this hour if you have to get out.